Hi, in this example we are going to see about creating a list view in Android. File, New, Android Project. So here I am going to have it as my list and uh, target is Android 2.2. So package name is com.ram.mylist. Finish. Done. Here as far as this is a simple uh, list view, we are not going to do any change in the layout. We will be having it as main.xml. The same view. So we are having a uh, Android 3.2 as a target. So we will make it into 2.2. Here we uh, will be having only the text view to display the corresponding information of the list. Let's move towards the source like uh, we will make change on the java file in the my list activity file here in the activity we have to make it as list activity this is one way that we can inbuilt list within your android application so when uh, you have added list view you, you quite naturally you have to import a uh, list activity then I will come on this particular form. Okay. Now, to get the input, I am creating a string, string array of name names equal to new of string, which has some values like um, uh, Linux, then Android, then um, I will have Windows also. Okay, that is fine. Done. I have to map it to an adapter. So set list adapter. What I have to do? I have to map it to an array adapter. So new of array adapter which has string. Okay, so string comma this um, it has to be within the parentheses so this comma so I have to map it to the layout of the application so here Android dot R dot layout dot simple list item one okay so then I have to close this parenthesis semicolon right so now when you have a look on it you can see that uh, that array adapter has not been imported so I am importing it so here the string so I will make it into string so now you can see that the error has been removed okay here I am having a parenthesis which I am supposed to remove so it's done now we have created a list adapter using the values which we are having as the strings array of some values with Linux Android and window then for this we have to have a associativity with the event here we can map it with on list item click so in order to perform that source override or implement methods on list item click so you can choose it so now you have got the thing our objective here is whenever I click the string Linux I should get you selected you have selected Linux whenever I click Android I should get the corresponding value that's so that is the objective of this a uh, small exercise so for that I am creating an object O equal to this dot get list adapter dot get item so the position so the position is is the parameter which we are getting over here so get item from position okay so that is done okay so here object is not zol so object Oh, this 
dot object o so o so let me check what could be the so get list adapter yes so it's done okay so what i have to do again is i am creating a string string keyword equal to so the value which i have got from the o to string so it's done then i have to add it to the toast so when i click it i should have a toast to display it toast dot make text okay so make text so here i am having a context the context is so this this comma so what is the value i have to get i have to get you have selected right then plus the value which i have got in keyword so how long it has to be there so the thing is i can have toast dot length long so the period so then i have to make it to show so dot show is there let's see that yes same done so now i have to check whether i am getting the list over there and uh, whether it is been used so when here you can see that i haven't uh, used the names to carry over the value here so what i can do is so i have to use comma names so the intimation which you, you are seeing over with the yellow one which you have seen earlier is uh, giving us an input on that part so let's see uh, what's happening when we run this application run us yes okay so it's uh, i hope it's starting so android we will be getting the result now you can see that the values which we had in the array adapter is now available with the list so here you have selected linux you have selected android you have selected window so it's a simple example which we have seen here which gives us an idea about how we can create a list in android application thank you